Okay, guys, this is uh, demo number two. It's the same. Uh, it's the same setup with the uh, Transporter 3D, um, except what I've done is I've uh, replaced the uh, narrow field of view lens with a standard lens with a wide field of view lens. Um, I'm not sure the focal length, but anyways, it's much wider than the the previous one. And uh, if you're wearing the Oculus Rift right now, you'll notice that you, there's a double image, and this is that IPD problem that uh, we discussed earlier. And uh, if I adjust the uh, IPD in, so somewhere right around here, you get a uh, proper IPD, um, and uh, you know you you. This is, a, I guess, a demonstration of the 2D mode as well. If people are interested in, uh, you know, what the 2D uh, video looks like on uh, on the Rift with the, the super wide field of view. Um, and one of the things I wanted to demonstrate was how the zoom function can compensate for, um, you know, a a, uh, a lens that has lens distortion that doesn't match the Rift. So if I zoom out and anybody's just watching this on YouTube, you're going to see in the corners of the room here um, where the wall meets the ceiling is, uh, is, is bowed from the fisheye effect. And now if, you, uh, if I zoom in and you're wearing the rift, at a certain point um, the, uh, the lines no longer appear bowed, they, they appear straight. Now obviously you don't want to be you know, correcting for uh, the lens distortion, but you know, with the zoom you kind of want to get your matched fill, so it's best to have a, a few uh, lenses that have a uh, wide field of view, and then just adjust the the uh, change the lenses and then adjust the zoom to get the right size. So you have a you know the best trade-off between uh, um, screen fill as well as uh, um, you know not losing uh, you know the resolution. So, anyways, that that's basically it. I can uh, show you if I uh, switch modes here. Um, this is just changing the IPD and then I can hit the next one and adjust the vertical alignment as well. So anyways, yeah, so demo of the of the 2D mode and uh, and you know how to adjust the functions.